It's time to take a look at your weekend forecast across the country. This is Weather AM. My name is Matt Hamill alongside meteorologist Rhythm Reed. Rhythm, this weekend forecast for some in western Canada looking pretty good. In the east, not so good. Some messy wet conditions. Well, that pattern is going to change in the west as well. But for this weekend, Atlantic Canada continuing to see another round of showers as this boundary pushes on through. Now, New Brunswick saw a majority of their showers through Friday, but another round is going to push in into the evening on Saturday and the Avalon you will be looking at that rain moving in for your Sunday and most of the heaviest rain is going to be right along the Bergio shores and across the Avalon anywhere between 20 to 40 millimeters is expected. Yeah, that's kind of the weekend outlook in eastern Canada. No shortage of active weather. And for Ontario and Quebec, that's ongoing as we begin the weekend on our Saturday afternoon. And that's going to start to clear up as we're going through Saturday. But Sunday, well, we have another active system impacting southern Ontario. This low pressure system is going to start out as rain for areas across the Golden Horseshoe as well as up to King Carden. But as we're heading through the morning period, it's also going to bring the risk for some isolated thunderstorms for areas in Hamilton. Toronto and even down to Niagara. They will start to clear up as we head towards the evening, but you may be woken up on your Sunday with a few rumbles and the risk of heavy rain as well as small hail is expected with this system. So we talked about for Western Canada, not a bad weekend, but rhythm as you highlighted, that's not going to last. That good weather looks like it's coming to an end in short term. And it's going to be a spring snowstorm across the region. Now we do have beautiful conditions as we go through our Saturday. Definitely where I want to be is Brandon and Winnipeg. 22 degrees feeling like summer, but we do have two systems to watch. We're going to have a low pressure that forms over Alberta. That's going to collide with a Colorado low in the beginning of the week. Now with this low pressure for Alberta, we'll continue to see that cold air infiltrate. That's going to mean that snowstorm, but luckily for areas across southern Ontario, We'll be getting the warm edge of this system, and that's what's going to bring more so rain across the region once again.